Assalamualaikum everyone welcome to my brand new video basically today I'm gonna tell you about how you can contact your multicollinearity test using Instata so let's get started multicollinearity basically refers to when there is a perfect or exact linear relationship between some or all explanatory variables that means it represents the higher relationship between two or more variables So if there is multicollinearity in your model then it may provide inefficient result. So in that case you need to detect if there is multicollinearity problem in your model. To detect the multicollinearity problem the most famous procedure is VIF test that is variance inflation factor and another one is tolerance inflation factor and we can conduct these variance variance inflation factor through this startup first of all you need to run your regression model after conducting your regression model you need to write the command vif and you need to press enter after that we will get the multicollinearity result that means here you can see the vif this is basically the variance inflation factor and another one is on divided by vif that means it is called tolerance inflation factor if the vif value is greater than 10 then it means there is higher multicollinearity problem if the tolerance inflation factor that means on divided by vif is less than 0 0.1 then there is higher multicollinearity problem so in this result we can see that all variables vif value is uh, less than 10 that means there is no multicollinearity problem and also if we look at the tolerance inflation factor we can see that the tolerance inflation factor value is greater than 0 0.1 so that means in this model the, there is no multicollinearity problem so now if we run another model from another data set uh, first of all we need to run the regression model then we need to write the common vif then press enter then here you can see that the vif value is greater than 10 it is very high than 10 that means there is higher multicollinearity problem in this model and also if we look at the tolerance inflation factor we can see that tolerance inflation factor value is less than 0 0.1 so we can tell that in this model there is higher multicollinearity problem from this multicollinearity detection test we can interpret the result via vif or on divided by vif so this is about how you can detect if there is any multicollinearity problem in your data set i hope you will like this video if you like this video please like share and subscribe my channel allah Hafiz.